Hello, I'm Jane Goodall. I'm calling for a public scientific debate to discuss what for me and many others is a really important question. Can the results of experiments on animals correctly predict the responses of human patients? A simple question, but one that has aroused bitter controversy. This debate being called by members of the UK Parliament will make use of the accepted peer review process. The two opposing scientific positions based on referenced position papers will be judged by highly qualified independent experts. Their job will be to determine which of the two positions is correct. More and more scientists today are concluding that experiments on animals are contributing nothing towards cures for disease in humans, but may in fact be providing information that hinders progress in this regard. This is why such a debate is so terribly important. We need to know the truth, both for the advancement of human medicine and for the sake of the animals. The intense physical pain and mental suffering caused by invasive experiments on highly sensitive non-human primates and other animals is well documented. In the autumn of 2016, I signed an open letter along with Sir David Attenborough and 19 experts in science and animal welfare calling for an end to invasive experiments on non-human primates. For my stand, based on ethical considerations, I was criticised by Professor Roger Lemon, a leading proponent of primate experiments. I don't have the scientific medical knowledge to take issue with Professor Lemon, but Dr. Ray Greek does. And as he will be the medical expert representing the position against using animal models, I would like to take this opportunity to ask Professor Lemon to agree to participate in this debate. Dr. Greek has devoted his life to exposing the fallacy that animal experimentation has advanced medical knowledge. In 2002, he was actually able to halt the creation of a multi-million dollar primate laboratory planned at Cambridge University by proving that the type of experiments planned could have no predictive value for human patients. Please join me in supporting the MPs who are calling for this vital scientific debate about the very future of invasive animal experimentation. Thank you.